Hey there, hello there, hello there, it's Drift Cutter Diamond welcoming you to another Stoko Hockey thing. This is video two in the series of trying to do the best per franchise with the 11 seasons I have for Stone Cold Hockey. Now you'll be seeing, you say, the others have eight teams, what happened? Well, simple. Because, yeah, you know, 75 onwards, yeah, I got all those eight seasons, but I, I, read, I had the 65, 68, and 71 seasons, and a, the New York Islanders did not exist until 1972, so thus the first three seasons don't have an Islanders team in it. So fortunately I have eight, so it's just basic quarterfinal, semifinal, final. Three rounds, we're going to take off. So you got the 2006 squad against the 22 squad, the 75 Islanders against the 2012 team, the 91 team against the 23 team, and the 94 against the 84. Now, it was randomly drawn and seeded. So, here we go. First game is going to be the 22 Islanders in overtime. Farlow and Moff beats Di Pietro. The 06 team was up 2 0 on two goals by Mateus Weinhandel. But Andres Lee and Matthew Barcel tied it. And then Barcel at 10 34 in overtime from Lee and Ajo. Not the Carolina player. There's two Sebastian Ajos out there. And in Japanese culture, Ajo is idiot. Ahoka! Uh, the 75 squad beat the 2012 squad 4-3. Billy Smith beats uh, Kevin Poulin. The 2012 squad had goals by Matt Molson, Beer, Josh Bailey, and P.A. Parenteau. 75 goals by Bob Nystrom, Bobby Bourne, Ron Stewart, and Andre St. Laurent. Holy St. Laurent. Uh, the 23 squad beat the 91 squad 4 to 1 as Sorokin beat Glenn Healy. The 91 team, Ray Ferraro, scored. But the other sports rate goes Brock Nelson with two, Ryan Polak and Nola Dobson. And then the other one, the 84 team winning 4 to 2. Smith beat Hextall. Billy Smith beat Hextall. Uh, the 94 squad third first, Pierre Turchon and Derek King with a pair of goals. But the other sports rate, Bossy, Nystrom, Trottier, and Bourne. Doing it. 75 and 12 to game two. 75 squad is now up to zip. Chico Fresh beats Al Montoya. The 2012 squad had Josh Bailey scoring a goal. Bob Bourne, Danny Potton, and Billy Harris are your Islander goal scorers of the 75 squad. The 23 squad is now halfway home for two win. Sorokin beats Lorenz. The 91 squad, Ray Ferraro again, and, and Ray Ferraro again. All three goals of the 91 Islanders have been by Ferraro, but Matt Martin, JP, JG Pajot, sorry, Cal Clutterbuck, and Bulldog scoring the goal for the Islanders there. And the 94 Islanders with the split, 5 to 2, big win for Hextall over Billy Smith. But 84 squad had goals by John Tanelli and Greg Gilbert. But the other goals, Ray Ferraro, Steve Thomas, Derek King, Pat Flatley, and Brad Del Garno. Not Del Giorno, Del Giorno, Del Garno. And the other game two sees the 22 Islanders halfway home, 5 to nothing win by Fadlimov. Ha, ha, shut up. And five different goal scorers with their first Polak, Dobson, Palich, Sekris, and Josh Bailey. The 22 Islanders. I have to take a look. Yeah, Josh Bailey and the 2012 squad. Josh Bailey for both. Oh, so he came back. Okay. Keep thinking Josh Bailey is a former kitchen ranger, but no, that's Justin Bailey. Anyway, 91 versus 23. Game 3 sees the 91 squad win 2 1 on the road. Jeff Hackett beats Sorokin. The 23 squad, Pellich scored, but the others, two goals, Jeff Norton and Pat Lalafontaine. The 84 squad wins 7 to 4 as Roy Nielsen beats Hextall. The 94 squad goes by Martin McInnes, Brad Delgarno, Vladimir Malinhoff, and Ray Ferraro. The 84 squad, Mike Bossy, Billy Carroll, Greg Gilbert, Fred Sutter, Brian Trottier, then Trottier finishing off, I thought he finished off a trick, with a goal, and Thomas Janssen, first Swede to ever win the Stanley Cup. The 06 Islanders win on the road 5 to 1 as Steve Pietro beats Sorokin. The only 22 goal was by Brock Nelson. The Islanders 
Oh six honors, five goals, two goals by Jason Blake, one by Sean Bergenheim, one by Miro Satan, and one by Sh another goal by Sean Bergenheim. Bergen Heister. And the twenty twelve Islanders went two to one. Montoya beats Billy Smith. Seventy five Islanders, Jerry Mahor had with the goal. Michael Grabner and Matt Molson for the twenty twelve squad. So we will have four game fives at the very least. The 84 squad wins in overtime. Their one went away. I'm going to semi. Billy Smith beats Jimmy McClellan. The 94 squad had Benoit Hoag, Pierre Turgeon, and Dennis Basque, who's a goon, scoring the goals. The 84 team, Butch Goring, Bob Nystrom, and Dwayne Sutter. With seven seconds left, the 84 Islanders scored that goal. And then at 8.58, after a five-minute major penalty for Steve Thomas, Mike Bossy finally scored on that power play from Tonelli. <coughs> The 06 team has tied it up with the 22 squad, 7 to 5. Garth Snow, remember him? He beat Sorokin. The 22 squad, Brock Nelson, Cal Clutterbuck, Brock Nelson again, Anthony Bavalier, and then Casey Sisikas. For the 06 Islanders, Robert Nielsen, Trent Hunter, Alex Yashin, Aaron Asham, Miro Satan, Miro Satan again, and then Jason Blake with the empty netter. 35 Islanders win in overtime. There are three went up. Chico beats Nabokov. The 2012 squad had Mark Strait, Milan Jersina, Andy McDonald, and Michael Grammer scoring goals. The 35 team, Bob Nystrom, Bob Nystrom again, Jerry Horvat, and Billy Harris. And in overtime on the power play after a penalty, a major penalty to Steve Stales, Andre St. Laurent, holy St. Laurent, from Jerry Hart and Billy Harris. And the other game four sees the 23 Islanders. Now three went up. Overtime heroic Sorokin beats Lorenz. All of the goals in the second period. The 91 squad, Ray Ferraro, Randy Wood, and Brent Sutter. The 23 squad, Peter Angfall, Bor Bo Horvat, and Matt Martin. But overtime heroics to Noah Dobson from Pollock and Parise. So we could have three winners. 35 squad, did they win? Yes, they did. 5 to 3. Chico beats Du Pietro. 2012 squad scored first. Two goals by Apolso and one by Matt Molson, but Billy Harris, Ed Westfall, Billy McMillan, Clark Gillies, and then McMillan again. Are your heroes? The 23 others, did they win? Yes, they did. They win 3 to 2. Farlumov beats Healy. The 23 squad had goals by Brock Nelson, Matt Martin, and Fashing. 91 others, Pat LaFontaine, and Ken Baumgartner with the goals. The 84 others, did they do it in 5? No, they didn't. The 94 others won. Hextel beat Smith. The 84 squad had Brian Trottier. Third is Pot that and Butch Goring scoring. The 94 squad, Pierre Turgeon, Pierre Turgeon, Pierre Turgeon with the hat trick. Then Steve Thomas, Ben Hogue, and Patty Flatley. Still around, huh? The 22 Islanders went on the road 6 to 4. So Rokin beats two bullets. There's two bullets. 22 Islanders were at 5 0. Susikas, Bovelia, Nelson, Sarnik, and Dobson scoring goals. They added one with Pollock, but. Mike York with two goals, Robert Nielsen and Jason Blake. Goals as the 22 Islanders win 6 to 4. Do the 22 Islanders win? The answer is no, we got a game 7. Every home team has lost, so it looks bad for the 06 squad, even though they won. Dubowitz beats Sorokin. Mike York, Jason Blake, and Alex Yashin with the goals for the Islanders. The 22 squad had Noah Dobson score. The 84 Islanders won in overtime. They'll move on to the semifinals. Rudy beats Hextall. People forget Kelly Rudy played for that team. 84 squad. There are three goals by Brent Sutter, John Tanelli, and Butch Goring. The 94 squad, Ray Ferraro with two, and Steve Thomas with one. But in overtime, it was Dwayne Sutter at 515 from John Tanelli and Danny Patan. Who won game seven? I don't want to look, but I have to. And yeah, the road team won every game. It's a 22 squad. 142, Sorokin beats Di Pietro. 22 squad had Andres Lee, Brock Nelson, Noah Dalton, and then J.G. Paschel scoring goals. The L6 squad, Jason Blake, and Alex Yashin. But that's it. So off to the semis. 75 takes on 23, and 22 takes on 84. It would be weird to see the 22 and 23 squads go head to head. I would like to see the other 75 or 84 team win the whole thing because they're historically as good as the other two cupcake teams. The 75 squad won game 1-2-1. One, one. Smith beats Sorokin. The only goals 
Fashing for the 23 squad, Jerry Hart and Danny Potten for the 75 squad. Meanwhile, this 84 squad went 4 to 1. Roly Milans and B. Farlamoff. Polak for the 22 squad. 84 squad, Billy Carroll, Dwayne Sutter, Andres Kellor, and Danny Potten. J2 sees the 84 Islanders win again, 3 to 2. Milans and B. Sutter 84 goals by Mike Bossy with two and Andres Kalor. Andy Greed and Noah Dobson for the 22 squad. The 75 others were 7 to nil. Chico Resch with the shutout over for our mom. Dave Lewis, Jude Druin, JP Parise, Colt. Oh, why does it Colt? Clark Gillies, Bob Nystrom, Billy Harris, and JP Parise. The heroes for the 75 Islanders. And the 75 Islanders win 3 to 1. Smith beats Sorokin. Paul Mary for the 23 squad. 75 squad Clark Gillies, Ed Westball, and Ron Stewart. The 84 Islanders win 6 2. They're up 3 nails. So we can have a pair of semi sweeps. Melanza beats Barlobov. The 22 squad got goals by Anders Lee with 2. Other goals Billy Carroll, Dave Longevin, John Tanelli, Greg Gilbert, Mike Bossy. And Mike Bossy again. Did the 84 squad sweep? The answer is yes, they did. 4 to 3. Big sweep for them. Smith beats another Ripken. The 22 squad had Paul Mary, Dobson, Rapitzek, and Barcel score. But the others, 84 squad, Clark Gillies finally scoring goal for that team. Frank Trecce, his fifth, Bob Bourne, his second, and Fred Sutter, the hero. But do the 75 squads go for the sweep? The answer is no. They lose 7-5. to five. Farlamov beats Billy Smith. So we keep going. The 75 squad, Jerry Horvat, Bob Nystrom, Jerry Horvat again, Andre St. Laurent, and J.P. Prise scoring goals. The 23 squad, Sat Prise, J.P.'s son, if you can believe that. Brock Nelson, Peter Angful, J.G. Pajot, Matt Barzell, Josh Bailey, and Noah Dobson. With the goals. But the fun can't last as 75 Islanders. Another shutout by Chico against Sorokin. Westfall, Potten, and Fortier for the goals for the Islanders. So we have the 75 Islanders against the 84 Islanders. 84 Islanders had to go to six games against the 94 squad and then swept the 22 squad. Billy Smith, 3 2, but Roy Melanson put him in that. He's 4 0 with a 225 goes against for Hockey Puck State. My bossy, 15 points. Brian Treche with 12. John Tanelli with 12. Bossy, and Trachier and Tadali, I think, I'll, think those three did not play for the 75 squad. No, they didn't play for the 75 squad. 75 squad, two five game series. Chico's 5 0 with a goals against the 1 5 9. They should put Chico in the net and get rid of Billy Smith. 11 points for Danny Ponte and 10 by Ez Westfall, 10 by Jerry Horvat. So, game one of the others' championship goes to the 75 squad, 4 2, as Smith beats Smith. And Bob Bourne faced his doppelganger. The 75 squad won again, 4 to 2, as Smith beat Melanson. Now, the 84 squad well, couldn't believe their luck, they lost. <coughs> Greg Gilbert and Brian Trottier for the 84 squad, 75, Ed Westfall, JP Parise, and two by Ron Stewart, former Ranger. Game 3 sees the 75 squad looking for the sweep, 3 to 2, as Smith beat Smith. Game four. Does the 75 Islanders get the sweep? The answer is yes, they do. Four to three as Smith beat Melanson. So 75 squad went with Smith the whole time and it worked. So the 75 team that lost the semis to the Flyers. And that's who we're going to do to finish the second video. It will be the Flyers who will get the call to the hall, if you will. So Smith beat Melanson, 75 squad. Goes by Sean Potthead, Ed Westfall, J.P. Cruz, and Ed Westfall. Yes, Sean Potthead is Daddy's brother. 84 squad. Mike Bossy, Butch Goring, and John Tanelli with the goals. But the 75 squad. What was their final total? Oh, they only lost twice. They didn't need Chico. Reschel. They didn't need Chico. They went with Billy Smith, and he made him happy. 
So that's who wins. The 75 Islanders are the New York representatives in this little tournament. Now let's take a look at the Flyers. Get the playoff setup done. So Philly will get their 10 teams in. They didn't have a 65 squad. So you're going to see a lot of repeats. But, you know, you'll see probably Bo Billy, Billy Clark, Bobby Clark on four of these teams. randomly put the, the flyer those flyer teams in different twenty two flyers and the twenty three squad. So there will be a preliminary round. With ten teams you're gonna have four fight it up. You got the ninety one and ninety four squads fighting each other and the eighty four squads fighting the twenty two squads. So that means the three oldest, 68, 71, and 75, all are in the quarterfinals. So here we go. The 22 squad against the 84 squad. Game one sees the 84 squad win 4 to 3 as Pelly Lindbergh beats Carter Hart. I think a lot of hockey fans will probably say, He who shall remain nameless for his you know what. But remember the, the old adage. He's, guilt, he's innocent until proven guilty, and the court of law will determine it. The 22 squad got goals by Willman, Cam Atkinson, and Kevin Hayes. The 84 squad goes by Daryl Sittler. Man, see the flyer colors just pisses me off. Tim Kerr, Bobby Clark, and Mark Howe. Yes, Gordy's offspring. Meanwhile, on the other one, the 94 squad wins 6-5. to five. That's Bruce, Dominic Russo beats Ron Hextel. I know Hextel did not play for the 94 Flyers, he played for the 94 Islanders. The 91 squad had goals by Pat Murray from Stratford, Pelly Elkland, Ron Sutter, Pelly Elkland, and then Rick Tockett. The 94 squad, Eric Lindros, yeah, the big E in his second season. Gary Galley, Lindros again. Gary Galley with his second. Joseph Branick and Kevin Deneen. Game 2 saw the 94 squad 7 nothing shutout. Russo takes down Ken Reggett. A lot of people will say, wait, didn't Reggett play in that for Pittsburgh in the playoffs and, and won a cup with them? He did, but that was the 92 squad, not the 91 squad. 91 was Peter Angelo, if you must know. So Russo with the shutout. Recky, Baratic, Baratic, Butsayev, Deneen, Lindros, Recky with the goals. Meanwhile, on the other preliminary round, the 22 squad wins 2-1 to one as Hart beats Lindbergh. Scott Lawton and Rasmus Ristolainen scoring for those Flyers. And one of the Sutters. Now, Ron and Rich Sutter both played, but unfortunately they don't give me the second letter to the initial R Sutter, so I have no fucking clue. Anyway, Game 3 sees the 84 Flyers win 6-3 as Bob Froze beats Martin Jones. Is that Martin Jones? But anyway, the 84 squad wins. The 22 squad, Nick Cates. Ivan Provodov and then Provodov again scoring the goals. The 84 squad, Ro Ro it's not Rory Fitzpatrick, Ryan Fitzpatrick, Bill Barber, Kitchener. Thought I forgot to say that. Inga Silasalo, Tim Erickson, Fitzpatrick again, and Bill Barber his second. So the 84 squad, Ross Fitzpatrick, okay, and the 22 squad, it was. Yeah, it was Martin Jones, so I was right. Well, anyway, the other game three sees the 91 squad win 7 to 4 as Reggett beats Freddy Shabbat. The 94 squad had goals by Mark Recky, Butsayev, Dmitry Yuskevich, and Dave Tippett. Yeah, future NHL head coach. The 91 squad scored Mark Pedersen, Pelly Eklund, Murray Barron, Scott Mellenby, Pelly Eklund again, Ron, Rick Tuckett, and Norman Lacombe. And you would probably be thinking, wasn't that that Boston player who had that brain hemorrhage? No, that was Norman LeFalier. Regardless, then the 94 squad wins game four. They're now up three games to one. Russo beats Reggett. The 91 squad had goals by Pat Murray, Pelly Eklund, and Shell Samuelson. The 94 squad brought Brandon Moore, Kevin Deneen, 
Spoutsayev, Michael Renberg, and Mark Recchi. The 84 squad still have three games, one to go to the quarterfinals. Lindbergh beats Martin Jones. 22 squad got goals by Farabee and Provenoff. Philly goals, Dave Bullen, Brian Propp, and Brad Marsh, all with their first of the playoffs. Do those 84 Flyers win game five? They do. Two to nothing. Shut up by Bob Frills over Sandstrom. Oscar Sandstrom. Philly goals by Sutter and Sinisalo. The 94 squad will get to the quarterfinals, winning 5 to 4 over the 91 squad. Sutterstrom beats Hextel. The 91 squad, well, there's not 3 to nothing. Craig Prube, Scott Hamoni, Pelly Eklund scored. And then Keith Acton scored for the Flyers. But in the end, the 94 squad wins. Yosef Beretic, Eric Landros, Michael Redberg, Mark Recchi, and Brett Fedick are your goal scorers. Quarterfinals, the 84 squad will face the 75 squad. Eek. And the 94 squad will take on the 68 squad. The 23 squad takes on 2012 and 06 against 71. Those those two matchups I've talked about, the last two matchups that I've talked about, those teams automatically qualified. So, first case for all of them, 1 0 in overtime. Urson beats Briskalov. Overtime goal by Travis Kadecki from Nate Cates and Kevin Hayes. I think that's Nate Cates. I actually should know. Noah Cates. Okay. So soon be Flyers fans. 84 Flyers win 2 1 over the 75 squad. Froze beats Bertie Perrant. The 84 squad. Sutter and Bobby Clark with the goals. Ranchi, the Riverton Rainfall Leach with the goal for the 75 squad. 71 Flyers shut out the 06 squad. 6 0 as Doug Favalle shuts out Robert Ash. Serge Bernier, Bill Lesiak, Bill Lesiak, Andre Lacroix. Gary Peters and Joey Johnson for the Flyers, 71 squad. And the 68 squad beats the 94 squad 5 to 2 as Perrant. Yes, he was a Flyer at that time before he jumped to the WJ. Yeah, the Flyers had him from the Boston system. And Soderstrom, the goals. Yeah, Perrant was with Boston and then drafted by the Flyers, 68. Leon Rolschfurt with a hat trick in this game. And singlets for. Brian Sutherland and Pat Hannigan. The 94 squad, Kevin Deneen and Michael Renberg scoring. Game twos. The 75 squad wins 5 1. Parade beats Lindbergh. 75. Joey Watson, or was it Joe Watson? I don't know. What's Lonsberry? Larry Goodenough? Who's brother Bob was an NHLPA guy who was a piece of shit sometimes. Bobby Clark and Moose DuPont. The 84 squad, Daryl Sittler. Just can't see him in flyer colors. The 06 squad with the win over the 71 squad. Ninamaki beat Favelle. The 06 squad, uh, Jeff Carter. Freddie Meyer, RJ Umberger, Sammy Kapanen, and Simone Gagne with goals. 71 squad, Bobby Clark, and Gendron. Jocelyn Gendron, maybe? The 68 squad up 2 nothing in their series. Perron beats Russell. The 94 squad, Mark Recchi, Mark Recchi, and Mark Recchi. <laughs> He's, they've got eight. Patrick didn't help. The 68 squad, Pat Hennigan, Leo Rushford, Eric Hoekstra, and Dodd Blackbird. And the 2012 squad wins 2 to 1. Chris Gallo beats Hart. 23 squad, Nick, uh, Noah Case with the goal. Couturier and Danny Briere for the 2012 squad. The goals. Game threes. The 71 squad wins 5 to 3. Bruce Gamble beats Robert Esch. The 71 squad had goals by Gary Dornhofer. Bill Lesek, Bobby Clark, Lesek again, and Bob Hound Dog Kelly. The 06 squad goes by Simon Gagne, Donnie Brashear, and Peter Forsberg. Going back to the Flyers. Forsberg was a Flyers pick before being traded to Quebec in the Lindros deal, but he went back to the Flyers. Went to the Flyers, I should say, in a sense. The 68 squad is now one win away from sweeping the 94 squad. Favelle beats Rousseau. 68 Flyers were up 3 0. Claude LaForge with a pair. Hoekstra scored, but the 94 Flyers. Renberg had two tippets scored, and then in overtime, it was LaForge completing the hat trick from Forbes Kennedy. 
the 23 squad wins 3 to 2 as Carter Hart beats Bruce Golf in overtime. The 23 squad were up 2 0. Joe Farabee and Anthony D'Angelo with goals. Claude Giroux and Matt Reed for the 2012 squad, but in overtime it was Lesinski at 1247 from JVR, James Van Ruzek, and Noah Cates. And the last game three sees the 75 Flyers take advantage with the overtime win. Perron beat Lindbergh. Two great Flyer goalies, the two greatest Flyer goalies of all time, going head to heads. 84 squad was up 3 0. Daryl Sadler, Brian Prop, and Mark Howe scored. It was Reggie Leach scored to make it 3 1. And then a 4 1 sent us out, though. It looked like they were going to win and take the lead, but the 75 Flyers chipped away. Kitchers! Bill Barber. Yeah, he played for the 75 Flyers, I guess. Reggie Leach and Don Selesky. And then the Riverton rival Leach scored in overtime at three minutes from Clark and Clement. Yes, that Bill Clement. Game four, will the 68 Flyers sweep? They don't. The 94 squad stays alive for one more game. Russo beats Favel. Sutherland scored for the 68 squad, but Rod Brandemore put up a hat trick. And Lindell scored a singlet. The 2012 Flyers have tied that series up. Brabrowski with the shutout over Hart. Four checks, Simmons and Hartnell to hit their first goals of the postseason. Um, the 84 Flyers win 5-4. They'll tie the series with 75 team. Lindbergh beat Perrant. 75 Flyers, Dornhofer, Lonsberry, DuPont, and Dave Schultz. Doing the job, the 84 squad, Bill Barber, Kitchener, Dave Brown, Tim Kerr, Daryl Sittler. Yeah, the Tim Kerr are your goal scorers. Uh, this 06 squad ties with the 71 squad. 4 1 is Eschbeek's Favel. The 06 squad Gagne, Umberger, Savage, and Simone Gagne. 71 squad had Andre Lacroix. A lot of people will be like, didn't Perron play for the 71 Flyers? Nope. He played for the 71 Leafs. And then he left for the WHA, and then the Flyers just snatched him up. Anyway, do the 68 Flyers win the series? The answer is yes, they do. In overtime. Favel beats Rousseau, finally eliminate them. Gauthier for the 68 squad, 94 was Deneen. Andre Lacroix, his first goal of the season of the playoffs on the power play after Conroy got in trouble for holding from Hoekstra and Gauthier. And the 68 squad moves on to the semifinals. The 2012 squad wins 6 to 3. Bobrovsky beats Sandstrom. 23 had Konecki, Konecki, and then Frost scoring the goals. 2012 squad, Forachek. Yager, yeah, he played for that team, I guess. For a check, Wayne Simmons with two goals and Sean Couturier with the empty netter. The 75 squad wins 4-3 to three on the road. Perron beats Froze. 75 Flyers goals by Watson, McLeish, Lonsbury, and Leach again. Reggie Leach. Sittler, Deforak, and Cochran with the goals for the 84 squad. And the 71 squad will go up 3-2. Gamble beats Nidadaki. That's Bruce Gamble, that is. 71 squad, Simo Nole, Gary Peters, Bobby Clark, Don Schock, and Simo Nole again. The 06 Flyers, Mike Canubo, Branko, Branko Rojanovic, and Cam, Kim Janssen. 2012 Flyers, did they win? Yes, they did. In overtime, Bruce Gallup beats Hart. 23 Flyers were up, Owen Tippett, but Claude Giroux scored to tie it, and then Max Talbot at 11.51 from Forachek and Yager. So the 2012 Flyers will join the 68 Brethren in the semifinals. 75 Flyers will join them, 5-3, to three, Perron beats Lindbergh. 84, Mark Howe, Tim Kerr, Tim Kerr. 75 squad, Clark, Clement, Schultz, Schultz, and Bill Barber, Kitchener. The 71 squad cannot win. They lose 5 to 2 as Ash beats Favel. 14 gave 7. 71 team Clark and Schmaltz. Philly goals by Peter Nevet. He was still around. RJ Elberger, Yanni Pitkinen, Jeff Carter, and Mike Kanubo. So who will join them? Personally, I say it's the 06 team to make it four different generations. And I'm wrong. The 71 squad wins. Bruce Gamble with the win over Robert Esch. Umberger scored for the 06 squad, but 71 squad, Bobby Clark, Johnson, Bob Kelly, and Serge Bernier. I want to know who that Johnson is. Jim Johnson. 
All right, so it's 71 versus 68, 75 versus 12. So we'll see someone from the 70s, the 68 or 71 squad, someone will face the newbies. So it's the two oldest against the, and the two newest. Game one uh, sees the 71 squad win 5-4 to four for the Bellbees Perrault. Yeah, Perrault didn't play for both teams. 71 squad goes by Jim Johnson, Audrey Lacroix, Bobby Clark, Bobby Clark again, and Barry Ashby, the winner. 68 squad, Sutherland, Hoekstra, Hoekstra, Peters. The 2012 squad wins 4-2 to two as they beat the 75 squad. Big win for Chris Golov against Perrault. 2012 squad, Danny Breer, Matt Reed, Matt Reed, Max Talbot. Reggie Leach and Rick McLeish for the 75 squad. The 75 squad rebounds in game 2, 4 1. Perron beats Bobrovsky. Um, Wade Simmons, Philly goal for 2012 squad. 75 squad, Wansbury, Barber, Kitchener, Leach, and Clark are your goal scorers. The 71 squad halfway home with the overtime win. Perron beats Favel. 68 squad had goals by Johnson and Peters. 71 squad by Bornhofer and Gendron. But Bill Lesek, his fifth from Gendron and Lacroix. Under Lacroix, before he went to the WHA, was a decent player. All right, so 71 Flyers, do they make it 3 nothing? They do, 6-1. to one. Favel beats Perrant. 68 squad had a goal by Dornhofer. With 6 seconds left, Rui Favel shut up it. But anyway, Watson, Lesek, Dornhofer, Dornhofer, Chandron, and Kelly are your goal scorers. 75 Flyers with the overtime heroics by Perron over Chris Galov, Rick McLeish, and Matt Reed, the goal scorers in regulation. Overtime was Watson from Clark and McLeish. McLeish finally scoring an assist. 75 Flyers, do they make it 3 1? The answer is yes, they do. 6 to 2. Perron beats Chris Galov. 75 squad. Good at all, McLeish, McLeish, Lonsberry, Barber, Kitchener, and Thornhofer. The 2012 squad, Braden Colbert and Claude Giroux. 71 Flyers don't get the, they lose it overtime. They had a chance. But Val Dis was in both games. Well, the overtime goals by Britt Selby, the former Leaf, called a trophy winner. 71 Flyers in game five don't win again. As Perrault beat Gamble. 68 squad, Lou Lingotti and Claude Laforge with the goals. Dornhofer for the 71 squad. 75 Flyers, they finish it up 5-2. to two. The Stanley Cup champs in real life do it. Perron beats Bobrovsky. The 2012 squad, Matt Reed and Wayne Simmons. And there is Watson, McLeish, Clark, Watson, and Barber. Kitchener is fifth. 71 Flyers. They lose again. They lose 2-1 to one as Favel beat Scamble. 71 squad, Larry Hillman scored, but Leon Rochefort and Claude Laforge scored. Unbelievable. But the 68 Flyers, a force of game 7. I just can't look. And the 71 Flyers win. Yeah, the 71 Flyers were up 3-0, right? Yeah. Favel beats Perrant. Schmaltz and Serge Bernier with goals for the 71 squad, the 68 squad, and Gotti. So the 68 squad forces a game seven, and they lose. Bad luck. So it's 71 versus 75, so a seven will be thrown. But the question on everyone's lips will be, is it a one or a five after? The 71 squad has Favell and Gamble both decent, and 71 Flyers had to go through two game sevens. So they've been through the wars. Dornhofer, 13 points. Serge Berger, J.G. Gendron, Bill Lesek with 12 points each. Bobby Clark with 7. I know Bill Barber did not play for the 71 squad. He played for the 75 squad. Which has Brady Pratt, the only goalie. Well, Wayne Stevenson or Bobby Taylor. But they don't need those two bastards. So the 75 Flyers, 1-6 and six and 5. Maybe even 4. Who knows? Bobby Clark with 19 points. Reggie Leach with 12. And Kitchener's Bill Barber with 10. Who will it be? 71 or 75? Game 1 sees the 71 team wins 3-2. Favel beats Parant. Goals by Bernier and 2 by Jim Johnson. Bob Kelly and Bill Barber. Kitchener. Scoring for the 75 squad. 75 squad wins 4-1. Parant beats Gamble. Bernier scored for the 71 squad. 75. Leach, Barber, Kitchener. 
Dornhofer, and Lonsberry. Game three sees the 75 squad win Perlon Gachion, Perron beats Favan. 71 squad, Gentron, Johnson, and Dornhofer with goals. Tom Bladenfile is going to go for the 75 squad, Rick McLeish, and Ross Lonsberry. In overtime, thanks to Kelly's penalty for too many men on the ice, Clark from McLeish. The 75 squad up 4 2. They are going to win game. Th They're up 3 1. Perron beats Gable. 71 squad, Simon Nolan and Bob Kelly. Rick McLeish, his eighth. Bill Clement, Reggie Leash, and Bob Kelly are your goal scorers. Do the 75 Flyers win in five? Yes, they do. Three to nothing. They weren't scared. Perron with a shutout. So the 75 Cup champs in real life are going through, and that means Buffalo will be the next, will lead off the next video because the 75 team, the 75 team they beat were the Sabres, so we'll go with Buffalo next, Perron beats Gamble, shout out, Bobby Clark with two goals, Reggie Leach with the other one, so the 75 Flyers who won the Stanley Cup in real life, took it to the limit, and won a few series, they rode Brody Perron all around, and Bobby Clark, but the 75 squad deserves to win. And that's all there is to it. Anyhow, I'm Jeff Diamond Adu.